Hello everyone and welcome back to my YouTube channel. So today um I'm actually doing kind of like a little um meaning behind the songs that I've been releasing my own material of course. So I wash in a pot so I can make myself something to eat, so bear with me. I'm sorry. Um so the first song I did was called Dear Death Friends and that song when I released it caused a little controversy with some few people. First of all, that song is about my experience in high school where I used to talk to myself a lot in high school when people called me crazy and stuff like that and whatnot. Hence imaginary friends, hence dear death friends. So that was me basically telling you guys my experience with it. And that's why it's called Dear Death Friends for a reason. The intro is the same way, it's just a little introduction to the song and stuff like that. Dear Death Friends is about my imaginary friends I had in high school that are no longer with me because I would send them to the light. Dear Death Friends. Okay? If you have an issue with the songs I release instead of assuming that's about you or whatever that may be, reach out to me. Reach out to the person who's singing the song. The other song, Random Freestyle, is basically about people in the world. In general. People who complain to artists for writing music or for writing how they feel or trying to make one artist um, go big and the others and the other artists go down you know like trying to lift one artist up and make the other one look bad and you know pinpoint them against each other like how they did with SZA and Taylor Swift you know they assumed that SZA was beefy with Taylor Swift because SZA posted something on Twitter but SZA cleared out their allegations that she's not beefy with Taylor Swift meaning straightforward what that song is don't have celebrities be against each other and don't bring artists down, lift them up, inspire them to write music some more. The other rest of them, like, um, Boyfriend Different is basically about my experience with past relationships with one person in particular, so that's why I did those songs and whatnot. And lately, my sugar hasn't been doing good, so when I release the music there for it now, I'm going to sound a bit out of it. That's because I'm a sugar level. Okay? And if you think I'm making it up, that's on you. That's your opinion. But you're not going to tell me what to do. I'm going to continue writing my music, doing my music how I want. If you don't like it, then don't listen to my music. Simple as that. Just pass it. Okay? Just pass my music. Don't pay attention to it. Okay? I'm not going to stop just because you don't like her, just because like, oh, you talking about this person. I didn't know me and that person went to high school together. I didn't. Um, the meaning behind boyfriend is basically about my toxic ex-boyfriend that I dated for almost three years who wanted me to change my body and stuff like that just to please himself. And that's just basically me telling myself that I don't need a boyfriend like that to tell me to change myself in any kind of way. The meaning behind Jake is basically an ex That song is basically me trying to get my gratitude to him. You know, he inspired me to write music and stuff like that and whatnot. I know and added some more details to it, but that's just a demo version of it. The actual original version of it is going to be released sometime in next week or the following week. The rest of my projects are basically about myself, my personal life, of the ups and downs of being gay and liking guys, 
having people who like you for that and right or having people who claim that they like you for who you are but then they go and turn and talk stuff about you behind your back which i had a few people in high school who supposedly liked me for that but then come three years later after we graduated high school or whatever come to find out they talk talking trash about me and and my sexuality did that. And now they're trying to be my friends again. And it doesn't work like that. So, yeah, that's just a little information about what my songs are about. About me, myself, and I. So don't right away go assuming that it's about this person or that person. Because it's not. It's not about anybody else but myself and my thoughts. Okay? Okay, we're good. Okay, capisci? You understand? Me entiendes or no me entiendes? Do you understand the words that I can remember? Because I'm being that serious. Because it's a new year, new me. Definitely. So if you have an issue with me, that's fine, baby. I don't care. I really don't care. If you have an issue with me, I don't care. That's not going to stop me for making my music. If you don't like me, oh well.